There's the kind of lifting and separating that can save your silhouette. Then there's the kind that can save your life by ejecting that unwanted piece of gristle from your windpipe. Saturday marked National Heimlich Maneuver Day. It celebrates the technique that saved more than 100,000 lives, including Ronald Reagan, Cher, Elizabeth Taylor, and Jack Lemmon. Ariel Wessler examines the doctor's breakthrough contribution. You may not recognize him, but his name is world famous. I don't know of anyone who does not know with a Heimlich maneuver. His invention, a celebrity itself, having appeared in film <gasps> and pop culture. No Heimlich maneuver developed by Dr. Heimlich, who woke up one night, obviously, and went, her fist, a hand, hoochah, 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 lobster. <laughs> How many of you know the Heimlich maneuver? Dr. Henry Heimlich. A chest surgeon from Cincinnati first developed the life-saving procedure in 1974 after reading about several choking deaths. It replaced the back slap as the main response for choking. Here's how it works. First, you'd stand behind me, wrap your arms around my waist. Then make a fist with one of your hands and put it against my abdomen with your thumb against my body slightly below my rib cage. Grab your fist and press in and upward. That would push the diaphragm up. That would compress the lungs, and you'd get that flow you needed. Of course, you don't have to be a superhero. The basic practice has become so widespread, partly because anyone can do it. We have had young children save other children. Still, at 93 years old, Dr. Heimlich himself has never had to save anyone using his own maneuver. But he's proud to hear from those alive because of it. For you to hear that is really wonderful for me. For the list, someone's life may depend on it. I'm Ariel Wessler.